It was a deadly weekend on the roads here in the Coachella Valley. Six people died in three separate crashes. Police say at least two of them involved alcohol. KMIR 6's Angela Monroe spoke with friends of one of the victims. Angela. 18-year-old Victor Regalado was a senior at Shadow Hills High School. Victor's friends tell me he was looking forward to college. But in the early morning hours Sunday, the Jeep he was a passenger in lost control and rolled on Adam Street in Indio. Victor died at the hospital. It's just devastating. You know, you wonder if it's all like, are you in a dream or something? You know, you just want to wake up and him be here next to you. Victor Regalado's friends can't believe the friend they love is gone. I called him, I texted him, Facebook. Um, I was just waiting for a reply or something that showed um, he had seen it, he was okay. Um, it is devastating. Friends kept vigil at the site where the vehicle Victor was riding in crashed. I knew Victor since we were about five years old. Victor had everybody on smiling. He just, everybody loved Victor for who, who he is. His personality was amazing. Many students at three local high schools wore white in memory of Victor. He would put everybody else's like, you know, needs before his and he just had a big old heart and he was just, the only sad thing is that he died too young and it just wasn't his time to go yet. Indio police say the teenager driving the Jeep was arrested for suspicion of drinking and driving. In response to this deadly weekend on the roads, CHP is doubling up their officers this upcoming weekend. When you start drinking, just realize you need to designate a designated driver. You lose your ability to, that judgment goes out the window as soon as you start drinking. So it's just, it's, it's a big problem and you know, we're out here, we're trying to do our jobs. We're like you said, we're, we're trying to double our, our units that are available, and uh, hopefully that'll be a deterrent to people. Victor's friends say it's not just the driver who's responsible for this tragedy. That's also a factor, but you can't, many people try to blame it on the driver, but you can't just blame it on the driver. You know, who provided the alcohol for the underage kids? Who hosted the party? You know, who let them get into the car? Why didn't somebody hold their keys? Why didn't anybody else offer a ride home, you know? His life got cut too short, and he was too young. He's going to live on. I just, um... Victor's friends struggle to find the right words to say goodbye to a dear friend. And the families and friends of five other people are also mourning the loss of their loved ones who died on Coachella Valley Roads this weekend. Not all the names of those killed have been released. Back to you, Gino.